a half-century-old building is getting a major facelift and a new set of tenants. George P. Vanier School opened in December 1960 with just 15 students. The brick-and-mortar building overlooks Kin Cooley Park and was built thanks to the fundraising efforts of volunteers who also established what has become the Core Association. The school closed in 2012 and now that same association is turning it into a 10-bed residence for people with developmental disabilities and dementia. Two of those beds will be used for respite services. For uh, family members, if uh, they need um, to go out of town uh, for whatever reason on, on a trip or some type of emergency and they're normally taking care of their um, family member, then they can opt to see if one of the respite beds is open here up at Vanier House. Local business Amron Construction has been doing the remodeling, adding washrooms to each bedroom and turning the gymnasium into a living room and kitchen. Each room will have a barrier-free design. Uh, each room will have its own like walk-in shower area. Uh, also on site here will be a, uh, we're calling it a tub room. It's, uh, there's going to be a specialized tub for people who have um, uh, severe mobility problems. and. Um, it's, it's a quite an, a capital investment to purchase a tub like this. I think it's upwards of $30,000. CORE already operates several group homes in Medicine Hat, but nothing quite like this. And being 53 years old, gutting the building was no simple feat. Total project is estimated to cost about $2.5 million. And that's primarily why the Alberta government got involved, was to support this type of uh, living arrangement. Um, so, as mentioned, we do have a number of group homes, and uh, this one will just be probably our flagship operation. Vanier House is expected to be completed in April 2014, but residents won't be able to move in until inspections are done. Seafried says that could take a couple of months. But it's going to be, it's going to be a great time, like in the springtime. Um, <clears throat> It's also CORE Association's uh, 60th anniversary, so we're able to celebrate that and uh, with, the, with the grand opening of uh, Vanier House. For Go Southern Alberta, I'm Christy Pick.